Happy Halloween! Today I wanted to show you guys how to make simple cake pops and decorate them for Halloween. For this we are using cake mix. Normally I do like to bake cakes from scratch, but cake mix works so we're going to use that. For this you're going to need candy melt, and I have white, orange, yellow, and dark purple. You're going to need either three eggs or four egg whites. And then in substitute for oil and butter, we're going to use low fat Greek yogurt and applesauce, which works just fine. And then you will need some decorating icing. I'm going to do the apple slice one first, which is fairly simple and requires practically no effort. We're going to add about half a cup of frosting and then mix it all together. It's going to get messy. Be sure to wash your hands. Oh dear. Oh, it's all purple. It's so much fun. Now it's nice and crumbed. And then we mix it in. At this point, you'll need some cake pop sticks. The first design we're going to do are pumpkins. Um, you don't want to make these too big because there's a higher chance of it falling apart. Now we're going to take a bit of our candy melt and put it in a separate container. And then we melt it in the microwave on 50% power. You want to be careful not to cook candy melt too much because it can burn, so you basically just want to get it to melting point. You're going to dip the end of the stick into the candy melt and then attach it to the cake pop. Do the same for the rest. Now I'm going to place these under the fridge and let them set up. We're going to melt the rest of our candy melt and start dipping our cake pops. And now we're going to tap off the excess. And we do it again. Make sure it's good and covered. Oh, they look quite cute. I like the cat one. 